Hey guys, welcome to MMA One on One. I'm your host Dan the Wolfman with the one and only jo Joey Beltran. How's it going, sir? I'm doing well, man. Doing well. You got you're here at Bellator here on the November second Mega Card, and uh, boy, life is kind of funny here. You got released from the UFC and turn around and you're in a big uh, big main event fight versus Rampage. Yeah, I, um, you know I'm definitely blessed with the, with this opportunity, and I, I plan on taking full advantage of it, dude. On November fifteenth, it's going to be an awesome fight. So how, how did this all come about? How did the Bellator thing happen so fast? Well, basically, um, I was released from the UFC. Uh, my manager, who's also the Bellator Fighting Championships uh, Spanish commentator, Manny Rodriguez, um, had been, and began uh, negotiations with Bellator. Things were going great. Uh, they were going to use me the next season, so I wasn't actually going to fight for them until February. But then I saw Tito got pulled out. Tito pulled out, so I called my manager immediately. He set it up. And so, I mean, I really owe it all to him, man, and, and fast, fast talking, <laughs> fast talking Manny Rodriguez. That's, that's awesome. Do you think that, um, you know, it's a good thing that you just had a three, you know, a three-round war with Fabiano Maldonado? I thought, and a lot of people thought that you won. If it wasn't in Brazil, you probably would have gotten two of the three rounds. But, um, you know, you think it's good that you're basically still in shape from that fight, so you're ready to yeah. go. You know, definitely, man. Definitely, there was. Uh, I took no time off. I was so pissed off and fired up after that fight. I just wanted to get back in the gym and punch somebody. Um, you know, and work off some of that stress rather than just be at home and dwell. So, I mean, I, I took about eight days off and just went right back into the gym. So. It worked out, man. It worked out. Do you think your style and Rampage's style, you're both basically boxer punchers. I mean, do you think that, that works out for, for your kind of fight, the dog fights that you like? Yeah, I mean, I definitely think it's going to be a, a, fi a fan-friendly fight, and I'm excited for it. I'm ready to go through hell to get the victory, and um, we're going to find out if he okay, is. Okay, and that's main event November 15th. I believe that's also the Shlomenko. Uh, yeah. title fight, right? Yes, so those sir. are two huge fights, guys, free on Spike TV. Definitely want to check that out. How is uh, training going? Alliance? Yeah, down at Alliance, things are going great. Uh, you know, training partners are doing awesome. We got Phil Davis, uh, Rafael Butler, who's also a heavyweight uh, for Bellator Fighting Championships, and you know, all the regulars over there. So. What about uh, Chandler tonight in the main event? How's he looking? And Chandler's a beast, man. That guy, that guy's a, uh, don't really worry about him. It's, uh, he's looking great, man. I can't wait. You think he's going to get it done tonight? How long do you think it's going to take? You know, I, I mean, uh, I'm not one for predictions, but if I, 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 I think, I think Chandler gets him inside a three. Yeah. Yeah. Um, okay, guys. I'm Dan the Wolfman. Please sub to my, uh, my YouTube page. Do you got anything you want to plug? Twitter or anything like that? Yeah, I mean, you can follow Twitter at Mexicutioner760. All right, guys. Thanks, and uh, we'll see you next time.